Today's video, we're going to be discussing a really important food, soy, soy protein, its effect on kidney disease. I'm going to be referencing a study also. So if you're new, make sure to subscribe okay, because we have hundreds of videos how to support kidney health. If you've been here before, welcome back. I'm Robert Galarowitz, naturopath, nutritionist, kidney survivor, living with a transplant a long time. So today's information comes from the Journal of Renal Nutrition, November 2022. The title, a little bit of a long title, soy protein as part of a low protein diet is a new direction in cardio and nephro protection in patients with stages 3B and 4 kidney disease. Well, this study, it just came out, and it's one of dozens and dozens of studies that I've seen supporting soy products with kidney disease, soy products to support good kidney health. So here they took people that were on low protein diets. And these people with the low-protein diets are also taking keto analogs of essential amino acids. If you don't know what those are, we have other videos about that. Now, instead of having animal protein in their diet, they switched it to a soy-based protein. Whether it's edamame beans, tofu, tempeh, there's a lot of soy products out there like soy nuggets, um, like soy uh, textured to be like a chicken, so like fake chicken from soy. Soy burgers, very popular. So lots of soy products out there. So they switched their animal for the soy products and they found tremendous benefit at the end of the study. So I'm just going to talk about some of those benefits. They showed that people that kept the animal protein, okay, their GFR decreased uh, at a faster pace or their kidney function got worse quicker as opposed to the people who had the soy product. People who had the soy products, they didn't get the blood pressure raising effects as the people that had the animal products, it was better for their cholesterol, it was better for their weight, a lean body mass, it was better for their heart, um, a part of your heart called left ventricular hypertrophy or condition with your heart and the uh, left ventricle can enlarge a kidney disease, it didn't enlarge when the people had the soy products in their diet. So consider adding it into your diet if it's not increasing it, but it's just so helpful, so tremendous, so many benefits with soy products for kidney disease in so many ways to cook it and prepare it. So thanks for watching everybody. Check out our hundreds of other videos about how to support good kidney health, how to improve kidney health from someone who's been through all stages, living with a transplant, still have my fistula. This is my passion, my life, why I wake up every day. Thanks for watching.